Hello, my friends. Um, this video, I'm making it because Marco Rubio, the piece of shit senator from South Florida, the biggest disgrace to the Latin community, fucking corrupt <clears throat> puppet of the Koch brothers and the rest of the <clears throat> billionaire trash that buys off politicians in this country he just submitted um, a project to pay Puerto Rican people um, five dollars an hour in my country in Puerto Rico and um, you know I, I it never ceases to amaze me and then the name of the law is empleo which means employment and they have, you know, it's an acronym for some bullshit. They're selling it like we're going to bring jobs to Puerto Rico and, you know, uh, you know, we're going to do you a favor and, and, and slave your children for $5 an hour. You know, we're just going to pay as long as we give them jobs, you know, those people down there, you know, they, they can do just fine with $5 an hour. And the reality is that the cost of living in Puerto Rico is higher than, than most of the states. Uh, I mean, it's 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 uh, like 36 cents per kilowatt to run uh, electricity versus I pay here in Florida 12 point something. It's probably going to go up a little, but uh, it's three times more expensive. Food is more expensive because because we have to import everything in U.S. flag ships or U.S. Merchant Marine, which is the most expensive uh, shipping on the planet. Uh, because of the laws that were established in the Jones Act, they're called cabotage laws, uh, and they apply also to Alaska and to I think Hawaii and stuff like that. And basically, that adds up about adds an extra thirty percent to everything that gets imported in the island. Uh, if you ever go to Puerto Rico, just go to the stores. We have the same stores that they have in the, on the states. In the states, it's you know Home Depot, everything. Compare the prices, and you'll see. Um, and, and this, you know, this douchebag wants to pay us $5 an hour. It's, it's, it's nothing but a concerted effort by the Republicans and the right-wingers. The same ones who established the seven-member the seven, uh, seven member dictatorship panel over Puerto Rico. And people say, oh, that's because they owe so much money. Yeah, they knew when they were um, loaning the money to Puerto Rican, the Puerto Rican government that the Puerto Rican government couldn't pay and they kept loaning them at this as you know uh, stratospheric <clears throat> really high interest rates and they knew they were going to collapse and they knew they were not going to be able to pay but they still did it because they had their uh, all the bondholders and the, the hedge fund managers and all this the, all the vampire vampires from Wall Street uh, they knew that they were, you know, they had the politicians in their pocket and they were going to, you know, do this, do a say, hey, if they don't pay, we'll just take over their entire economy and we'll take their, their pensions. Um, we'll take, we'll start, they already sold 350 schools and taken them. We'll, they'll take everything. They can, they can sell anything that belongs to Puerto Rico to pay the, uh, the Wall Street uh, uh, goons. And um, they're doing it. They're doing it right now. They're going to lower the. They're they're already lowering. They're going to lower the the minimum wage in Puerto Rico to five dollars an hour and basically enslave people. So, you know, basically, I called I, I called the senator's office and I told them, you know, I offered him to say, ask him why doesn't he pay the five dollars an hour to his mother and his children, you know, because that's you know that, that's what he deserves. Those people actually uh, deserve that. So, you know. Fuck you, Marco Rubio. Fuck Republicans. And everybody who signed on, the Democrats, Republicans, I don't care who they are, who supported the seven-member the seven member, uh, Puerto Rican dictatorship panel uh, to, uh, to take over any law that gets passed uh, in Puerto Rico by Puerto Rican uh, lawmakers can be trumped by, by, uh, by this member. And originally, still... Any law that gets signed in Puerto Rico, the U.S. Congress has a trump card that say, "No, we, we don't care what you what you said. We're gonna, um, you know, outlaw that law or uh, make it unconstitutional, whatever. Even if it is constitutional, they don't care. They have the prerogative. So, um, 
that's what's going on in Puerto Rico, uh, 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 courtesy of the United States Congress.